Hey, what is going on, pros and presses? It's Mr. Lyman HD here, and welcome to another drinks review. Today, it's going to be on VMAX, and it's going to be on the cranberry flavour. So, I got this particular drink out of a uh, random Polish shop, and I cannot remember the price. I do apologise, um, because I didn't actually get a receipt. But I think it was, again, around 50p or something like that. It wasn't too expensive, and it wasn't on the cheap end, so it was around 40 50p. So anyways, uh, this is a Polish drink, uh, just to let you guys know, so I can't read half the stuff on it. So anyway, I'll give you guys a full V60 of the can. So we have a very cool looking logo design with the VMAX and artwork on the front, very cool looking design. Obviously the can being cranberry flavour, we have a pinky, purpley, reddish type can. And again, we have all the ingredients on the back in Polish, I can't read. On the bottom we have uh, nothing, and on the top we have everything standard silver. So, professional activation, VMAX energy drink, cranberry. Um, so I can kind of guess what stuff does mean. For example, on there, it does say 30 milligrams per 100 mil. So again, that is the caffeine. And like I just said, it contains 30 milligrams per 100 mil. Uh, sugar, um, I can kind of tell as well, is 11 grams per 100 mil. The vitamins, I can kind of tell again, because it says vitamina, and it's got B12 and B6. And it's got niacina, which is niacin. And then I'm assuming the one below is panophenic acid because 99% of the time it is going to be panophenic acid in that order. Uh, can't be much else on it. Like I said, said the sugars, I've said the uh, vitamins. Uh, it's full sugar, so it doesn't contain any sweeteners, I assume. But yeah, I really can't read any of those ingredients at all. There's nothing else to read, is there? I don't think so. Nope. It was imported from... Christina Vitamin SA somewhere, yes. So anyways, it's nice and cold. I have got a cup, let's go straight into it. Hopefully it doesn't explode over me. So I'm assuming the colour is going to be red. Uh, I'm assuming it's going to, well, I don't know, taste the cranberries and smell the cranberries as well. Now, I do like cranberry juice as a juice, but obviously it's different in fizzy form and energy drink form. Don't explode. There we are. Right. Never know, it could be a completely different colour. Also, oh, it is red. I thought it wasn't fizzy then for a second. It seemed quite unfizzy, didn't it? So, no, but it is fizzy, of course. Uh, not too fizzy, but it is fizzy. So, we have a nice, deepish, reddish colour. It's not really see through. It's right, see through a little bit, but not too much. The smell. Oh, smells really strong. Yeah, it does smell really, really strong of cranberries. Yeah, bar me. <laughs> that smells really strong. But nevertheless, guys, let's taste some. Ooh, that is really strong. Blimey. That is really, really strong, sweet flavour. Cool. That is really strong. Blimey. I haven't tasted any drink of flavour that strong for a while. That is quite a, quite a strong cranberry flavour there. It does taste the cranberries, or, you know, cranberry... That is, that is actually decently strong flavour. I've, oh, I've really haven't had a flavour that strong for a while. That's quite nice and strong actually. You just get you get a big old kick of it. So it does taste quite sweet though, and a bit not sickly, but it does just taste quite. I don't have to say it. Just yeah, it does taste quite sweet though. Blimey, yeah. Whew. That is sweet, guys. That is sweet. Um, it seems alright. I probably wouldn't drink another one because it's maybe that sweet. I don't really don't mind sweet stuff, but I don't know. The kick on this seems really strong. The flavor on this seems really strong. Um, but yeah, overall, it's okay. It's okay. You know, it's again, it's nice to have you know a different flavor rather than just a weak cranberry type flavor like another cranberry energy drink, which not many of cranberry flavors are about. But it's nice to see it. It's nice to see them being different. Um, but yeah, I I won't give it a. I'll give it a, in the middle between a thumbs up and the middle because it's. You know, it's got a stronger flavour, but sometimes you know, that may be too sweet for people. But it's not, at least it's not on the weak end of the spectrum. And So I'll give it in the middle. But yeah, interesting drink, guys. Very interesting drink. But as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all later.